so after having the calculation for uh, twiddle factor 4 and 6 now it's the time for twiddle factor 8 so for twiddle factor 8 your n will be 8 so in this in this case we will just prepare this particular matrix so in this matrix you have w8 so you will have 8 columns and 8 8 columns and 8 rows right so in in other videos i have discussed you i have discussed about the methods how to make this particular matrix so w8 you will write as it is so 0 into 0 w8 is to 0 w8 is to 0 because 0 into 1 whole will be 0 second will be so this is just multiply this 1 and 0 this is 0 2 and 0 is 0 so w8 is to 0 like this if you multiply you will have this particular matrix ready after having this matrix the next step is to draw a circle and in this circle you will divide a circle unit circle into eight equal parts how to do this take angle 45 degree and so this is a unit circle so this is my x and this is my y and this is unit circle so hypotenuse is one after having this you can apply your sign 60 what is your sign 45 right here sign 45 is equals to opposite side see this opposite side is one y and hypotenuse is one so y by one okay so you can multiply 1 into sin 45 that is sin 45 itself so y is equal to sin 45 that is y is equal to 0 0.707 after that you can multi uh, apply cos 45 cos 45 is adjacent side that is x i will write here x upon hypotenuse that is 1 so 1 so x is equal to cos 45 cos 45 value put it x is equal to 0 0.707 after getting these two things ready you can just write x and y x is uh, your real and y is imaginary so in if you are writing imaginary then 0 0.707 plus imaginary j 0 0.707 after getting this point you can mark the other eight points in the circle similarly if you mark this, if you see this point and if you see this point you will just have a difference of c minus because it is in the second quadrant like this you can do so minus 0 0.707 plus j 0 0.707 after that you will consider this two axis as well okay this time in the six point total factor we neglected the imaginary axis because we ha had to get six points only now in this eight points you will just select these two values as well okay imaginary j and minus j rest all is simple just remember this matrix is quite huge because it has eight rows and eight columns after having all these things calculated like the previous videos go check that out for twiddle factor 4 and twiddle factor 6 after understanding that twiddle factor 8 will be easy okay so finally after placing all the values you will have your twiddle factor 8 that is w8 so this is the whole matrix okay just remember this it is very difficult i can say but if you have question in your examination then you will have to do this okay so steps are very easy first thing draw the circle divide it at an angle 45 degree and then you are set to go so i hope you got this video and thank you so much for watching do let me know in the comment section how was the explanation part